hello in this video we're going to learn an important function which is called the sum product so now the question is multiply these two and put it here to find the monthly income so what you should do is equals this multiply this enter and scroll it down so this gives you the product of these two columns now take the sum of this column now a shortcut to take the sum is this button here so click on it and click on sum that will take the sum of that column so what we did was we took a product first and then we took the sum of it so this cell here is actually the sum of the product so this is the sum product now the main question here is can we do all of this with just one simple function so the answer is yes and the function is called sum product so you should do equals sum product open a bracket select the first column comma and then select the second column and close the bracket you don't deal with the product that you just made you only deal with the individual columns and press enter once you press enter they should give you the sum product of these two columns product first and then it's sum press enter so you see that this value is the same as this value so this is the sum product of these two columns now the other question is what if you just wanted it for january just wanted it for february and so on that is called sum product with criteria so we'll do that here so for sum product with criteria the formula changes a little bit so you do equal sum product and open two brackets this time select the first column and now instead of a comma put a star and select the second column close the bracket put another star open another bracket now select the column in which your criteria belongs so this is the column in which your criteria belongs and say that in this column look for January so you say equals and click on January Similarly, if you're doing February, you would click on February. If you were doing March, you would click on March. And close the bracket and close the bracket again. This will give you the sum product for only the month of January. And press enter. Now, if there are no commas, just go up here and click on this comma here. This will give you a format with thousand separator. So this is the format we want the answers in now to check if this is correct we can just take the sum of january here to check if we got this right the sum of these four that is january should be the same as the answer that we got there press enter you see that this value is the same as this value so very important sum product and sum product with criteria now what you can do is you can drag this down to make sure if it works now, this is something you should practice on your own and ask questions below if you're able to drag it down or no any other questions you can type in below 